Mr. Speaker, with permission, I'd like to group this question with number 10. Last week, we set out plans to clear the initial decision asylum backlog of legacy cases by the end of next year. Over the summer and autumn, the Home Office reduced the number of older asylum cases by 11,000, and the number of asylum caseworkers has doubled. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Last week at the International Development Committee, we heard from organisations working closely with refugees in the UK. I was disappointed but not surprised to hear Enver Solomon, the Chief Executive of the Refugee Council, say they were not consulted about the proposals to tackle the backlog announced last week. Why has the government neglected to widely consult with experts and would the Minister be willing to consider their recommendations if I was to write to him? Yeah. Well, of course I'd be interested in the views of any of our stakeholders, but the Prime Minister set out a very compelling case last week to radically re-engineer the end-to-end -end process with fewer interviews, shorter guidance, less paperwork, specialist caseworkers by nationality, including tackling Albanian cases and reforming modern slavery as well, reducing the cooling off period from 45 days to 30, all steps to clear the backlog as quickly as possible.